Hi, I'm Bryony. Welcome to Yoga with Bryony. Today is day eight of your 30 day yoga and Pilates challenge. So if you're feeling fine and you want to get strong, slowly roll out your yoga mat and let's get started. Hi, welcome back to the mat today. I hope you're well today. So first of all, come into a comfortable seated position of your choice. So you can either sit cross-legged or you can bring one foot in front of the other. Or you can come into a kneeling position. Whichever feels good for you today. Okay, so we're going to take a moment here to start coming into the present moment, to start settling into our space. So taking a moment here to ground down through the thighs, ground down through the sits bones, feeling that amazing connection to the mat. Loop the shoulders, sitting up nice and tall, tucking the chin in slightly and open your chest gently, your heart space and feeling that beautiful line from the base of your spine all the way up to the crown of your head. And then I invite you here to close your eyes or soften your gaze. And we're just going to take a moment to start settling into our space. Feeling that connection with the mat. Perhaps you can imagine the roots going down from your sits bones, your thighs, all the way down into the earth. and then visualize that beautiful upward current of energy from the base of your spine all the way to the crown of your head and out. And then place your hands wherever feels comfortable for you. And then perhaps you can start connecting to an audible Ujjayi, audible, victorious, oceanic breath. Taking a moment here to let go of the day thus far, putting any to-do lists on hold. And remembering this time is for you. Time to practice self-care and self-love. So when you're ready, slowly open your eyes. Okay, so when you're ready, we're gonna inhale in and we're gonna move the body over to the right. Shine the chest forwards and your heart space. Exhaling over to the left, draw navel to spine. Inhale over to the right, ground down through your sits bones. Feel that connection with the mat. Exhaling, navel to spine. Great, good job. Okay, so inhale. Allow your heart space and chest to shine forwards. Exhaling back. And then we'll reverse the circle, so inhale over to the left. Remembering to keep your sits bones firmly planted onto the floor. Inhaling left, press away from your foundation. Press into your hands if that feels good for you. Exhaling, navel to spine. Inhale, allow your heart to shine forwards. Exhaling back, great, good job. Okay, so coming back to centre. We're going to plant the right palm onto the mat. Inhale, reach the left fingertips up. Feel that amazing line from your left sits bone all the way to your left fingertips. Inhale in, exhaling over to the right. Inhale back to centre. Exhaling now, 
plant the left palm on the ground. Inhale, reach the right fingertips up. This time feeling that amazing stretch from the right sits bone all the way to the right fingertips. Inhale in, exhaling over to the left. Remember to ground down through the right sits bone and don't collapse in the chest. Open up your chest, open up your arm. Inhale back to center, one more time to the right. Plant the palm, reach the fingertips up. Exhaling over to the right. Open up your chest, your shoulder. Inhale back to center. Exhale, plant the left palm. Inhale, reach the fingertips up. Exhaling over to the left. Great, good job. Okay, so coming back to center. Bring the hands to Namaste. Hands to heart center. Inhale, reach the fingertips up. Open up your palms, your chest, floating the fingertips down. Okay, so press away from your foundation. Roots arise. Fingertips reach and touch overhead. Exhaling, hands to heart center. Great, good job. Okay, so now we're going to extend the legs out long in front of you. Feet are hip width distance apart. Flex your toes towards your nose and ground down through your thighs. Engage your pelvic floor and feel that beautiful line from your base all the way up to the crown of your head. Okay, so hands can be planted to the sides or fingertips out, or you can bring your palms behind you, whichever feels comfortable for you, as long as you're still finding elevation in the spine. Okay, so we're going to inhale, flex the toes towards the nose, exhale, point. Inhale, flex. Exhale, point. Inhale, flex, feeling that amazing heel to sit bone connection. Exhale, point. Inhale, flex. Great, good job. And then just take a moment here to spread your yogi toes. Bring awareness to your feet. And by spreading your toes, this helps to increase the strength of your feet, which obviously then in improves posture and balance. Okay, so when you're ready, we're going to circle the ankles. So we're going to draw big circles with the big toes. So, okay, so we're going to inhale, flex the feet. Exhale, point. Inhale, flex. Exhaling, point. Okay, so we're going to inhale, flex the feet. Exhale, point. Inhale, flex. Exhaling point. Great, good job. We're just going to reverse the circle. Careful not to collapse in the spine. So inhale over to the right. Exhaling forwards. Inhale back. Exhaling forwards. Great, good job. Okay, last we're going to inhale, flex the feet. Exhale point. Okay, so now we're going to bring the right foot and cross it over the left thigh. And then hold your right ankle with your right hand. And we're just going to take a moment here to circle the ankles. So we'll rotate the ankles one way. Remembering to sit up nice and tall. And then rotate it the other way. Keeping the left toes flexed. Then when you're ready, interlace the fingers and bring them to the outer edge of your right foot. Keep sitting up nice and tall. Slowly lift the right foot up towards you. And then we're gonna slowly rock gently here from side to side. Whilst flexing the left toes, grounding down through the left thigh. And one more time, finding that beautiful line from the crown of your head to the tip of your tail. Okay, so rocking gently here from side to side, keeping the shoulders away from the ears. Okay, so when you're ready, we're going to bring the left palm to the left side of your thigh. And then we're just going to slowly reach the leg, right leg forwards and back whilst keeping the left toes flexed. Inhale forwards, exhaling back. Remember to keep grounding down through your left thigh. And just find any playful movement here that feels good. 
perhaps you'd like to bring the sole of the left foot onto the mat and you can come further back and you can go right over to the side so whatever feels good for you today in your body okay great good job okay so extend that leg out long and then we're just going to repeat that with the left foot so bring the left foot over the right thigh flexing the right toes ground down through your right thigh sitting up nice and tall and then hold your left ankle with your left hand and we're just going to take a moment here to rotate the ankle followed by the other way okay great good job interlace the fingers bring the hands to the outer edge of the left foot inhale sit up nice and tall keeping the shoulders away from the ears grounding down through your right leg inhale in exhaling we're just going to slowly rock gently here from side to side feeling that amazing opening in the left hip okay so when you're ready bring your right palm to the outside of your right hip sit up nice and tall and we're going to inhale the leg forwards exhaling back remembering to flex your right toes inhaling forwards exhaling back and then one more time you can bring the sole of the right foot onto the mat and find a bit of playful movement here so you can come over to the sides bring the leg out to the left finding any organic movement here that feels good for you okay great good job okay so this time we're going to bring the legs together toes are flexed reaching the arms forwards spread the fingers out wide arms are just a little bit lower than shoulder height okay so inhale sit up nice and tall exhaling out great good job okay so inhaling back engage your pelvic floor and your abdominals keeping a straight back exhaling forwards great good job okay so flexing your toes inhaling coming back keeping that flat back position engaging your pelvic floor exhaling forwards okay we'll do it one more time because it's so good for you inhaling back grounding down through your thighs engaging your pelvic floor exhaling forwards great good job okay soles of the feet come to the mat feet are hip width distance apart palms are behind the thighs sitting up nice and tall keep the shoulders away from the ears and then one more time we're going to take a moment here to massage up and down the length of the spine so we're going to inhale come back we exhaling forwards inhaling back exhaling forwards great good job inhaling back exhaling forwards this is great for the spine great for your spinal muscles spinal nerves great for waking up the body okay so last time come forwards one more time reach the arms forwards inhaling exhaling using your core strength slowly lower down vertebra by vertebra great good job hug your knees into your chest and take a moment here to rock gently from side to side okay so extend the left leg out long and then flex the left toes arms are by your sides with the palms facing down inhale reach the right toes towards the sky if this feels uncomfortable you can bring the sole of the left foot onto the mat okay so during this exercise it's important that the shoulders the spine and the pelvis all remain in contact with the mat so when you're ready bring the right leg over your body inhaling in exhaling with control and grace draw a big circle over to the right inhaling back to center exhaling down remembering to keep the right hip in contact with the mat inhale rise up exhaling lower 
Inhale, rise up. Exhaling, lower. <clears throat> inhale, rise up. Great, good job. Okay, so now we're going to reverse the circle. So inhale over to the right and down. Exhaling, left. Inhale, rise up. Exhaling down. Great, good job. Okay, we'll do two more circles. Inhale, rise up. Exhaling down. Inhale, rise up. Exhaling down. Great, good job. Okay, so slowly lower the right leg onto the ground. And this time we're going to inhale the left knee up towards the chest flexing the right toes and then inhale the left toes up towards the sky if this feels uncomfortable you can bring the right sole of the foot onto the mat okay so one more time feel that contact with the shoulders the spine and the pelvis with the mat okay so inhaling exhaling we're going to bring the left leg over the body point the toes draw a big circle with your left big toes inhale over to the left rise up exhaling right remember the left hip should remain in contact with the mat at all times right toes are flexed inhale rise up exhaling lower great good job we'll just do it one more time inhale rise up exhaling lower Inhale, rise up. Okay, so now we're going to reverse the circle. So inhaling, exhaling over to the left. And lower. Inhale, right and up. Exhaling, lower. Inhale, right and up. Exhaling, lower. Inhale, right and up. Exhaling, lower. Inhale, rise up. Slowly lower the knee to the chest, hug the knees into the chest and rock gently here from side to side. Feeling that amazing massage in your lower spine. Okay, so great, good job. Okay, so now we're going to lie down on the edge of the mat. So with your right arm bent and your head resting on your right hand. And then your neck, your pelvis is all in one beautiful line. Hips are stacked. Left hand is resting gently in front of you. And then bring the legs out into a diagonal. So now the toes are pointing towards the right hand side of the mat. Okay, great, good job. Okay, so during this exercise it's important to look straight forwards, don't look at your legs. Okay, so gaze is looking forwards. Engage your pelvic floor and your lower abdominals and we're gonna inhale and draw a line with your left toes across your right leg. Inhale, rise up. Left toes point towards the sky, exhaling lower. Allow the leg to hover, inhaling, draw a line across your right leg. Inhale, rise up, exhaling lower. Great, good job. Okay, we'll do it one more time. Inhale, rise up. Toes reach towards the sky, exhaling lower. Great, good job. Okay, now we're going to reverse the circle. So inhale, rise up, exhaling, lower. Allow the toes to hover, inhale, rise up, bending the knee, exhaling, lower. Great, good job. Okay, so last time, inhale, rise up, exhaling, bend the knee and lower the leg gently, allow the leg to hover. 
Okay, and now we're going to pulse the leg for 10. You can either keep your left hand where it is in front of you, or if you want more of a challenge, you can bring the left hand on top of your left thigh. So we're going to pulse for 10. Gaze is looking straight ahead. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and lower. Ah. Great, good job. Okay, so now we're going to repeat that on the left side of the mat, but I'm going to do it on this side so I can show you. So if you come onto the left side of your mat, so one more time, your head, your neck, your shoulders and your pelvis are all in one beautiful line, hips are stacked, engage your pelvic floor. If this is uncomfortable for you, resting on your hand, you can rest on the block and then bring your left hand in front of you. Okay, or you can rest on a rolled up blanket or a towel. And then move the legs so they're in a diagonal line from the hips all the way down to the left corner of the mat. Great, good job. Okay, so gaze is looking straight ahead. Don't look at your legs. Engage your pelvic floor. And then your right palm, don't collapse into the right palm. It should be there just as a gentle support. So when you're ready, we're going to inhale in and draw a line with your right toes across your left leg. Bend the knee, inhale, rise up. Exhaling lower with grace and control. Great, good job. Okay, so inhale, draw a line across your leg. Rise up. Exhaling lower. Inhale, draw a line, rise up, exhaling lower. Great, good job. Okay, we're going to reverse the circle, so inhale, rise up. Exhaling, bend the knee, lower the leg down. Inhale, rise up. Exhaling, bend the knee, lower the leg down. Allow it to hover if you want more of a challenge. Inhale, rise up, bend the knee. Exhaling lower. Great, good job. Okay, so we're just going to allow the leg to hover here and we're going to pulse for 10. So you can keep the right hand where it is or if you want more of a challenge, you can bring the right hand to rest gently on the outside of your right thigh. Okay, so we're going to pulse for 10. You're amazing. Nine, keep going. Eight, smile. Seven, you're strong. Six, you can do it. Five, halfway. Four, nearly there. Three, it may hurt. <laughs> Two, one, and lower. Ah, great, good job. Okay, so now we're gonna transition into a tabletop position. Okay, so wrists are underneath the shoulders. Spread the fingers out wide. Claw away from your fingertips. Tuck the chin in slightly. Draw navel to spine. Come up onto the tops of your feet and find that beautiful line from the crown of your head to the tip of the tail. Okay, and then curl the toes under. And then we're going to inhale, drop the belly, starting from the tail, opening the chest, your heart space. Look forwards. Exhaling, peeling the hips back into downward facing dog. Inhaling, lower the knees. Drop the belly. Look forwards. Exhaling, child posture, sending the hips back. Curl the toes under, drop the belly. Open your heart space. Look forwards. Exhaling, peeling the hips back, coming into downward facing dog. Inhaling, lower the knees. Dropping your belly. Draw a line with your nose, look up. Exhaling, back to child posture. Inhale, rise up, and then bring the knees and legs together and rest your hips gently on your heels. Slowly bring your hands to Namaste, hands to heart center. And we're going to close this practice by bringing the thumbs up to the third eye. The light in me bows to the light in you. Inhale in, 
exhaling to bow, namaste. Thank you so much for joining me today for this practice. I hope you really enjoyed it. And I hope you're feeling stronger, more alive and more refreshed. And I really look forward to seeing you soon for day nine, when you're feeling fine. Okay, great, good job. So I look forward to seeing you soon. Take care, enjoy the rest of your day. See you soon. Bye.